شكرا Good morning lovely people today is the 20th of February and I am coming to you barefaced from the kitchen Today I am going to do a bit of a different video which I think some of you will appreciate but I'm going to take you through this is why I'm pretty much face naked just up out of bed have my breakfast I've got wrestling puppies there somewhere Lex is away in Australia so that's a quick life update today I am going to take you through pretty much my full hair skin body beautifying tutorial on what I do so that's why I started the day off with a clear face but one thing I have to say before I start this video is that there is no pressure on anyone to buy any of the products I use these are ones that suit me and that I enjoy using any of the products that are in this video which have been gifted to me I will let you know but the majority I actually choose to buy myself and most of the products will come from your local supermarket to begin with, I think it's really important to stress that no amount of lotions and potions and things like that that you put on your skin and your hair are going to outweigh a bad diet. So first of all, to have clear skin, and yes I have one big zip there right now, but to have clear skin, strong hair and nails, anti-aging properties, where you must begin is with a very good diet. So I recommend a good, healthy, balanced diet. Number two, I'd recommend drinking a lot of water. The majority of your body is made up of water, so you need to intake the water. And right now, uh, my mouth feels really dry because I haven't had my water, but that's because I'm going to show you what I take supplement-wise. And also another very important part of having a healthy, body, skin, hair, nails, is sleep. You need your rest guys, you need to be able to allow your cells to recover every night. Sleep is so essential. I know a lot of you have busy schedules, you might be mums, dads, have really long working hours, but really make sleep a priority. Um, if you have to set an alarm to make yourself go to bed a little bit earlier, I know a lot of us get sucked into Netflix series, we get sucked into our phones, but try and do a digital detox from a certain time of the evening. I myself like to read a book before I go to bed and that is my way of kind of getting to bed early and it just sends me to sleep every night. Starting off before we go into the products I use, like I'm going to go through body products, face products, hair products, the whole... 360? I don't know. The whole shebang. We're going to go through it all. Right now I'm going to take all my supplements and the majority of my supplements are geared towards cell rejuvenation, anti-aging, healthy metabolism. So I'll just take you through them and they will kind of indicate what I'm taking aside from a healthy diet because I would like to think that I do have a very healthy balanced diet and I take in sufficient calories for my body to allow it to be strong and healthy. So starting off with some water, I try to take in three litres of water a day and recently since I have teamed up with Prozis I've been adding this um, H2O infusion. I like the milky almond flavour. I cannot recommend this highly enough. It is, it sweetens your water and it has the added benefit of 2000 milligrams of vitamin C a day. Vitamin C is essential for your immunity so if you're fighting off a bug or just for glowy complexion all that jazz. I add this in every day and you just simply pour it in so get it like this and in it goes and I just sip on that throughout the day and throughout my workouts get my water in and again I say water is so essential for cell rejuvenation so I'll mix that up nicely and they have loads of different flavors like so I think nearly 20 flavors so depending on your preference I love this one but there are some really yummy flavors. So this is a zinc tablet. Zinc is essential for cell rejuvenation. I take zinc all the time, every day. I find it really helps my skin. If you've got acne or really bad skin problems, it definitely helps to improve um, and rejuvenate your skin. Also, it's really good for if you're working out in the gym for cell rejuvenation. Obviously, when you weight train, you are breaking down the muscles. So this 
this little one here is going to help build that those cells back up and repair them and build big muscles. So then we have selenium. Selenium is an essential, look on the outside of all the Prozis tubs, it actually says what they are used for. So it says for oxidative stress and for maintenance of good hair and nails. So I do get a lot of compliments on my hair. Part of that is down to good genetics. I have come from a family of people with long luscious locks. So part of it is um, good genetics, but also, I look after myself and I look after my hair and I take my supplements, so selenium, really good for antioxidative anti stress and uh, breaking it down and I just usually take one of these in the morning with all these other vitamins with my water. Then we have vitamin E, now vitamin E is um, again for oxidative stress. Now oxidative stress can have an effect on your digestion, it can also have an effect on your skin. We're exposed to a lot of oxidative stress daily whether it's UV or pollutants in the air so taking vitamin E very good for fighting the oxidative stress that we encounter each day as we're out and about. Biotin, this is just essential for strong hair and nails and for um, a, a strong metabolism. It has been proven that taking biotin daily will increase your resting metabolic rate. So that means that even when you are not um, exercising or training, taking biotin will help you um, burn through calories and increase your metabolic rate every day. So take that. Then we've got L-thyrosine. L-thyrosine now for me is more about um, a weak thyroid that I have and I've been taking it daily for a long time. I definitely feel like most people could benefit from this unless you have an overactive thyroid. If you have an overactive thyroid, please consult your doctor for taking this supplement. But for me, I find it um, amazing. Then I've got collagen. Now, the pros is from collagen. This is the um, collagen with magnesium. Magnesium, again, another essential for uh, uh, digestion and for good muscle function but this collagen is unflavored so I just simply add it to coffee but I have ordered the pina colada flavor so that I can make some nice um, flavored smoothies with it collagen again anti-aging so good for those fine lines and wrinkles for plumping out skin so if you're in your 30s 40s plus and you're finding that you are Looking a little bit worse for wear, I definitely would recommend getting a collagen supplement and this one from Prozis. They also do one uh, collagen and uh, protein mix, which I actually used this morning in my oats. And um, yeah, essential daily. You need to be taking it daily to see the results. So don't take it one day and think you're going to look 10 years younger. You need to be on it and be taking it every day for about six weeks before you start seeing any significant results from it taking collagen. So that is a quick rundown of the supplements I'm taking. I also take in protein daily, usually um, a whey supplement. I also take in a high protein diet. All these things, taking in extra protein is good because protein is essential for cell rejuvenation and for muscle growth. So if you're in the gym trying to build muscle, you need to be taking in enough protein. I myself take in about 120 to 140 grams of protein a day and that is sufficient for me. Next um, I'm going to show you what I do. I'm going to give myself a little bit of a self care day to show you what I do for my hair, my body, um, my skin etc just generally and remember if you want to purchase any of the Prozis products they are available uh, through the link down below. For the next couple of weeks, if you spend over a certain amount on Prozis using my code Lainey as discount, you'll get 10% off, but you will also get a special little gift. So look out for that. And that's my way of saying thank you to you for shopping through my link. I always like to give something back to my followers who've supported me and support the companies that I work with. So as this video is about skin, hair and body, I'm going to take you through kind of a pamper session. So I usually do these once a week, maybe once every two weeks. I probably don't do it often enough. And I know that self-care is so important, both for your physical body and also just for mentally to just rejuvenate and um, feel good about yourself. So I'm going to pop you on a shelf up here and I'm in my bathroom 
Um, so not beyond suite, we have a bath in the house and it's kind of where me and Lex come to relax. We put on a bit of Netflix, we fill the bath. I'm just gonna quickly take you through um, my beauty regime. So every day I use uh, this to remove all my makeup and as I am putting on a face mask for while I'm in the bath, I want to cleanse, pre-cleanse before I do the face mask. So it is a charcoal micellar water, which when I first started using kind of stung a little bit and I was like, oh, this doesn't suit me, I'm not gonna use it. But I've read about purging your skin and getting used to new products. So I just stuck with it for a week and following the week, um, I saw a marked difference in my skin. Um, there was a lot of little pimples coming out where it was taking out all the impurities, which I find after doing a face mask as well that I'll get like a pimple like I have here right now um, because I think it just draws out any impurities in your skin. But I really like this product. Um, as you can see, I've been using it about a month and to be honest, Lex has been using it too. Um, so it just find, even if you're not wearing makeup, just use it before you go to bed and it gets rid of all the dirt and grime that builds up on your skin through the gym or just generally. So I usually just go in an upward and outward movement, you know, to stimulate lymphatic drainage and all that kind of jazz. Um, I really do concentrate around my mouth and chin and my nose because that's where I tend to get breakouts if I do get breakouts. So I'm sorry about the random outfit, but I haven't gotten dressed today because I've just been at home working and I'm not planning on leaving the house, so apart from to walk the dogs. For my little treat to my skin, I love under eye masks. So this is one that I picked up in uh, Body Care. So I picked these up and they're actually really nice. So it's a colloidal gold marine collagen. To be honest, I don't know how effective they are, but I find that any kind of under eye mask that has collagen in it just feels like it plumps it out because that is kind of, I suppose, my problem area. I am 37 and um, I do look after my skin and I drink plenty of water and everything, but I just feel like little things like this can really help. So this is what I use. I, I have bought a number of them, but this one is really lush, so I'm gonna have to keep the packaging so I get this one again. Um, as you can see, it's like a little jelly pad. You can pick up loads of different ones from different stores, and I'm gonna put them on, and then I'm gonna follow it with um, a bubbling charcoal mask. I did one of these last week or the week before, not realizing that it was a bubble one, so I just thought it was like one of those sheet masks that would detoxify my skin, and then it all just started bubbling up and um, it was amazing. I felt like super cleansed and super rejuvenated. So most of them, you leave them on for about 20 minutes. I'll just check, yeah, this 15, 20 minutes. So what I'll do is I'll run a bath, then put these on and hop in the bath with my mask on, chill out, watch some trashy Netflix and just relax and enjoy the process of beautifying. So on to what I use in the bath. Now baths, especially if you are weight training a lot and you get aches and pains, or if you're doing any kind of strenuous activity, um, I feel like baths, I'm not really a bath person, but baths are very effective at treating kind of aches and pains. So if you don't have a bath, I'm really sorry, but if you have the opportunity, like when I used to go to hotels in our last house, we didn't have a bath and I always brought bubble bath and salts with me whenever we went to a hotel and it had a bath. So I took advantage. But this is what I'm using right now. I picked it up in Asda, so it's just like a supermarket brand. I've seen it in a number of places, so you can pick it up. And it's Epsom salts, um, and it just helps to uh, draw the lactic acid out of sore joints. And you can pick up loads of Epsom salts. Now they are coming in like varieties of smells, etc. And this one is kind of a calming and serenity one so i think there's like lavender or something and there's cbd oil on that and you know my passion for cbd oil and how good it is and i'll be going into that a bit later when i talk about my skin and breakouts and stuff but i'm going to use this um usually about a cup full in a bath and then i'm just going to soak with my mask on and then i'll be back to you once i've de toxified and clarified and I'm feeling lovely and relaxed. Before I hop in the bath, I just want to say that um, normally when I have a bath, I will also do um, a hair mask, but 
Today my hair is actually only freshly washed, but normally I would put a hair mask on and wash my hair, but it's only been done yesterday. These are the two hair masks that I would go for. Olaplex, because I've got highlights, if you have highlighted hair, I get this on Amazon. Um, you may be able to get it from your local salon, but it is brilliant for uh, dry damaged hair it literally helps rejuvenate the hair and bring the moisture back into it so. and then i also love this mask and you can see it's almost gone so um again both lex and i use this and so it is an ogx product yeah. i've worked with ogx on campaigns in the past and to be honest I love their products, love their shampoos, conditioners. They are my go-to for my hair. Um, I love the Biotin and Collagen Hair Shampoo and Conditioner. It just gives me lovely, full, uh, clean hair. And if you have dry hair, they have coconut oil ones. So I definitely would recommend them. You can get them in most of your supermarkets and in Boots, Superdrug. Anywhere you go to, you'll be able to pick up OGX. But don't be... Um, it, don't be put off by the price. I know it is about seven pounds per bottle, but they will often have offers on where if you buy three items, get one free, that kind of thing. So I love this mask and I am happy to pay for it, but this was actually gifted. Just so you know, I'm just being transparent, but love it and use it very frequently. Now on to bath time. I will see you when this whole face is rejuvenated. So I'm out of the shower and I am feeling fresh. Right now I'm going to take you through the beauty products that I use. I'm not going to put on any makeup. This is literally what I put on my face and body after the shower in the morning pre um, doing my hair, makeup and all that kind of stuff. Because I think that the foundation of um, your skin and your beauty comes from like the basic creams that you put on. And I think people are so focused on what concealer and foundation they're using and they're forgetting about the prep of your actual skin to make sure that it can take these products daily so i don't use a lot of products and i don't use expensive products because i have in the past and i'm finding that a lot of the supermarket brands are just as effective if not better to start i have a different regime from day to night i will take you through both but it does vary from day to night Right now I've got a tattoo that is healing. I've been using this Yayo body butter and I literally it's like solid. It looks like a hair like product or something but you put it on and it is absolutely so divine. If anyone's ever had tattoos you'll know how nice it is and there's so much controversy out there of what you should and shouldn't be doing with your tattoos but this has just been just delightful on my tattoos it really soothes it it helps with the healing process and it just smells amazing as well so i got it from my my tattoo artist lisa she has it in her store but i'm sure if you look online um it's made in the uk it's vegan so and i use it literally on like i've got hand tattoos and i just moisturize it in there and it's not going to do your cuticles any harm either guys so for my body then because i don't use that all over because it is obviously a bit more expensive than your regular body butter normally i like to use the soap and glory um products but i've ran out so i just got this um in asda it is a vanilla coconut i love coconut scented um, products so that's what I usually just use all over my body after I shower you should always moisturize guys your body needs it because even though you're in the shower or the bath you're actually taking moisture out of your skin now I won't take you through the moisturizing but I do moisturize all over head to toe and then I smell again delightful as it is daytime right now this is a product I got in Aldi in their special buys section. It is a vegan eye cream and you kind of have to shake it because there's coconut oil in it and it separates slightly. But as I use it on my eye, I'll just put it on one eye and show you. I think it is like amazingly effective. So I put it right around and just kind of like dab it on. I don't like to rub it in too much. You kind of just want to dab it on and have it like soak in itself. Well, I think you can like visibly see the difference when you put it on but it's just it, I haven't ever really invested in a proper eye cream before but I have quite sensitive skin around my eyes and you know the eyes show up all your lines and wrinkles and um, they show your age you know you can see through the windows to the soul 
so I just dabbed that on. That was from Aldi. Hopefully they'll get it in as a more permanent fixture. You can get it on um, Aldi online. I also got this same in a day cream. So again, it's Aldi own brand, but I found it too heavy and I think that might have been what gave me the pimple. I'm not really sure. It was like a massive pimple that's gone well down now. It was like a sore one but yeah i stopped using it and i only got it because they didn't have the one i usually use which is this one so this is the aldi own brand facial cream and it's just so nice and light and um i just dab it on and onto my neck as well This cream is just so nice and light and um, it just soaks into your skin and it's just the perfect primer before you put on your makeup and it just feels so good. Um, it doesn't have a strong scent, I have quite sensitive skin and obviously I am in my 30s and I feel like it really does make your skin kind of nice and glowy and pretty and ah. Oh. This is a CBD balm and I featured this before um, on my Instagram and on my YouTube and we had it in a lovely little jar and then Lex dropped the jar and it broke but we didn't want to waste the product so we've put it into these little containers but I tend to put it on where I've got any kind of ailment. I, I like I have a sore shoulder right now so I'll literally rub it in to where it's sore and like CBD is such good healing properties you're not going to regret it. It does have quite a strong CBD smell like it does smell like marijuana but obviously you're not gonna get high off it unfortunately it's literally just has all the medicinal properties without the psychedelic so final thing I use all the time, this is Paw Paw. If you live in Australia, you'd be looking enough to get it all the time. I got it as a gift. I think you can get it in Boots and I've seen it in TK Maxx for sure, but I just love it. Just, just on my lips or if my eyelids get very dry, I'll put it on there for extra moisturizing. And it's just so nice and they have like a tinted red one that I actually sometimes use on my cheeks as blusher and it gives you just like a really nice tint to your lips and wherever else you want to use it. So that is it. That is my face, daily face routine before I put on any makeup. Now for my nighttime routine, again, I use my um, micellar water cleanser, very simple nothing too extravagant i don't go in for all these different products i just simply use that and um, i use the eye cream like i showed you earlier again i use the pawpaw on my lips and um, just because you're going to bed doesn't mean they don't need to be moisturized i'd like to point out not at all sponsored by aldi but if they want to sponsor me or another video i'm happy to collaborate with you guys because i use all your products um, but here is the overnight repair concentrate and it is just amazing. If you've ever used the Kiehl's Midnight Recovery Oil, it's very, very similar. And I'm on the second bottle of this because I just like, I'm super generous with it. It's about five quid in Aldi. You can usually get it in the beauty aisle and it's just so lush and it just smells amazing as well. So at night, this is what I use on my face. I've started using a nighttime body moisturizer and I just put it on my arms and my upper body and it has just like a really nice um, lavender and chamomile smell that helps you sleep. It's like lovely and rich and I just put it on my upper body and it just makes me smell so amazing before bed and just rub it in. And it's like sleepy, sleepy time after you use that product. I don't tend to use any like supplements to help me sleep, but if you are suffering a lot with anxiety or insomnia, I would recommend taking um, 6-HTP, which is a um, serotonin booster and it can help with insomnia and like um, a lot of anxiety and things like that. But as of late, I have not been using that, but just, be wary if you do start using it, you will have to wean yourself off it because it is not something that you can just take and leave at night to night. You, you need to be consistent with it and then reduce down your um, amounts that you use. And that is available from Process. Moving on then, when it comes to my smells, 
I'm a double deodoranter. Anyone else out there use double deodorant? I like to use this Shore. It's like a 48 hour confidence one and I just really like that. It's just really super strong. I'm very self-conscious about smelling. I feel like I go to the gym and I don't want to be the stinky person in the gym. And then I actually am just using a super cheap, again from Aldi, it's like 60p a bottle and it just smells great and it stays on, which is really important because I've used other ones, more expensive brands that a couple of hours later, I can smell the sweat on myself and this, it gives me the confidence. Go Aldi again. Then my perfume, because you like to smell sweet as a flower, because I use Flower Bomb and that is my go-to. Mm. And I just waft that. I usually get a couple of bottles of it as gifts at Christmas and that keeps me going for the year because it's not cheap guys, not cheap. Maybe I should do a wish list on Amazon. As I said before, my hair should be lovely and clean still because I only washed it yesterday. So I'll pretty much just run the brush through it and maybe style it a bit, but we're going for the natural look today. So I do get a lot of comments on my hair. Again, um, I am blessed with good hair genetics. My whole family have good hair, but these are the products I use just to give it that extra boost. As I said, I use a lot of the OGX shampoos and conditioners. And when I have washed my hair, I like to use this um, Maui um, blowout mist thing. And it just helps with brittle hair. You just spray it all over your wet hair before you blow dry it. And I definitely feel like it prevents breakages when you're blow drying your hair. Because I can be a bit rough on my hair, to be honest. And this helps with that. So on the ends of my hair, I use the OGX Argan Oil. Um, and I just put a little pea-sized amount onto the ends of my hair. I will sometimes, like this morning, I put some onto the ends of my hair again. I do have highlights in right now. And obviously that can dry out your hair a bit. And you want to look after your hair, you know? You don't want to be chopping all, off all the length. I'm trying to grow my hair super long. That's my goal. It's getting down to my waist. So we're getting there. All my supplements and everything are obviously helping as well. You just have to be on it and be consistent to see results. Nothing is going to work overnight. It's not gonna happen in a week. You have to be very consistent with all supplements and all products you use as well. Be consistent with them, stick with them for a while before you start seeing results and decide you don't like them. I hope you enjoyed the video. I am now going to go and I'm feeling very relaxed. So I'm gonna go and chill out bring the dogs for a nice walk, get into my jammies and have a nice chilled out evening at home. And then hopefully I'll see you in the next video. Remember, if you want to buy any of the products from Proses, hit up the links down below and use my code Lainey and you will get a 10% discount plus a free gift. See you next time. Yeah, I'm Superman, I spend my time flying high Going round, but I'm always getting wayside Some people trying to shit on me I said, girl, you can sit on me Cause bitch, they be hating